This is a message for me. <laughs> it looks like English, but hey, can you read this? Maybe it's like a coded message or something. Ugh. Whoa. It says top secret meet at 6 p.m. Whoa. The mirror helped me decode this message. Thank you, mirror. So it's flipped. The mirror flipped this in an image. And that's how I was able to read it. But wait a minute, it says 6 p.m. And it says 6 p.m. But I thought 6 flipped is 9. So the mirror is flipping, but it's only flipping things left and right and not up and down. Why does the mirror know that it has to flip only left and right and not up and down? Get it? Well, look at mirror me. I say, hi. It's my right hand, but it seems to be his left hand. And I do this. It's my left hand, but it seems to be his right hand. Now, the mirror is flipping me in the image, but only left and right. My feet are still down there and my head is still up here. Let me show you. See this. The eraser of the pencil is to my left and the tip is to my right. And even in the reflection, the image of the eraser is to the left and the image of the tip is to the right. There is no left-right flipping. So, if the mirror is not flipping the image, how does this happen? Who flips the image? We do. Now check this out. I'm holding a word up that reads L-I-G-H-T from left to right. And the reflection also reads L-I-G-H-T from left to right. But this is not how we see words. We don't use transparent papers all the time. We see words written on opaque objects, which means we don't see a reflection at all. So what do we do? We flip the word and see a flipped image. Check that out. When the word is flipped, the image is flipped. If the image is flipped, the word is flipped as well. Now, where do we see words in the real world? On things, right? Like this, on this t-shirt. You can see Baiju's written there. But the mirror does not show any reflection. We need to flip the t-shirt and we see the flipped word Baiju's. Isn't that so cool? So that means mirrors don't do left-right flipping. They don't do up-down flipping. What else could they be doing? Check this pencil out. I have the tip and I have the eraser. If I keep it against the mirror, you'll see this, that the tip is closer to me, the eraser is further away from me. But check the reflection out. The eraser is closer to me and the tip happens to be away from me. Mirrors are flipping front and back. That explains everything. Or does it? If I keep the pencil out here, Forget about me, look at the mirror. The eraser is closer to the mirror. The tip is further away from the mirror. In the reflection as well, the eraser is closer to the mirror and the tip is further away from the mirror. That's what mirrors do. They don't do any flipping. No up down, no left right, no front back. They just show a reflection where the image is as far away from the mirror as the object is outside the mirror. Isn't that so cool? That is something to reflect upon. Ah, now we know what mirrors do and what they don't. If you ask me, mirror image coded messages will never go out of fashion. Try that with your friends. 6 p.m. <laughs> oh, it's almost time. I need to get to my secret meeting. Oh, wait, before I go, there is a case where a flat mirror can produce an image that looks like up and down are flipped. Can you tell me where and how? Hint, hint, have you been near water bodies? 